everything looks familiar, it's because I've been kind of sick. I wouldn't say sick. I've just been literally under the weather. Um, I, uh, I, I don't respond well to storms. <laughs> I get massive headaches from storms. Sometimes so bad that they're migraine level. So, been literally under the weather for a few days. And then yesterday I went and got my COVID booster shot. So, yeah, but we have time sensitive stuff to deal with. So, the look will be something familiar. The tea will be something familiar. So hello and welcome to Dommy Tries This. I hope you brought your kappa. Uh, this is a coffee mug that my daughter found at Kroger. It is a Starbucks mug. It is in green, which means it qualifies as Christmas for me. We've done Christmassy nails with gold, green, and red. Kind of. Those two colors are almost exactly the same. That's kind of cool. At any rate, in our mug is a... Good Earth Sweet and Spicy Original Tea. I'm having this because I'm not feeling well. Uh, this has all the things that you want when you're not feeling well. Um, where is it? It has orange and lemongrass and peppermint and ginger, which are all things that are supposed to help like your nasals and all that stuff when you're sick. So let's get a sip and we will get started. Okay, I put in too much sugar. That was my husband all <laughs> telling me never enough sugar. Uh, but yes, I put too much sugar in that tea. I can tell. It, it's, it's not, the sweetness is not dying down. The ginger is getting stronger than the last time I drank it, which was about um, three minutes ago. Anyway, we're moving on. We're just going to get this done. So this is a Walmart box. It is not a seasonal box. This is their, as I recall, self their self-care box. And I wanted to get that out there in case anybody was interested in their self-care box. Now these, their seasonal boxes are about seven or eight dollars. Uh, you do not pay shipping at seven or eight dollars total. Uh, these boxes are about ten. And um, this feels actually pretty heavy. Uh, but the things in the seasonal box don't really change. You are going to get a good value I've not been disappointed in the value. Sometimes there are things that I don't want to use from my Walmart box, and I can usually give them to someone else. But in general, let's go ahead and open this up. In general, they're really good boxes. So yeah, let's just go ahead and open this up and see what we have. Okay, so Walmart Beauty, the Walmart Beauty box. This has stuff that we have in it, so we're going to set that aside. There are some, like I said, this is the self-care box. And it looks like most of these are full size or close to full size. I gotta see what that is. Let us pull this out. What are you? Oh, I bet I know what this is. Okay, so we'll take that out. This is the Wood Wick Crackles As It Burns Fireside. It's a candle. Oh, I love that lid. Doesn't smell like it's very strong. I don't think I have any way to start this. Maybe when my husband comes back in, I will have him start this and we'll find out if it actually does crackle. I love this top. That's neat. And this is like a little glass you could keep using later. That is very cool. Okay, already pretty pleased. I'm not, I'm, I love candles. I don't use them often because of my allergies, but I, I love candles. Okay, so what are you? This is... The Find Your Happy Place Catching the Sunrise Foaming Bath Bomb. I don't take baths. I will give this to my oldest daughter. She likes bath bombs. She collects them, actually, to some degree. Uh, but I am uncomfortable in tubs. <laughs> I feel very claustrophobic in a tub. But um, she will enjoy that, I'm sure. And then we've got... Liquid IV Hydration Multiplier. Now, I've heard about these. This is powered by Cellular Transport Technology. 
uh, non-GMO electrolyte drink mix. This is watermelon. Um, we'll have to give it a try. Um, I always, I'm always skeptical about these kinds of their claims for these kinds of things. But that's interesting. Then we have the Daily Concepts Exfoliating Dual Texture Scrubber in mild. There's gentle, mild, and vigorous. And we believe that good thoughts attract good things and that getting clean inside and out is definitely a good thing. Okay. We know we can't always control what happens in life, but we can control our reaction. And most of the times, we find that a shower or a bath will lead us to the solution. Okay. We work to inspire and get inspired, delivering daily concepts and everyday products that enhance the human experience. We are here to change the world, your world, one shower at a time. That's cute. Uh, I do have problems with exfoliators. They actually bother my skin a little bit. I don't, I have found that I don't like them much, but let's open this up and see what they mean. Ugh. Somebody knows I can't open things. Nose. Open. Okay. It's poofy. It's got a little handle on the back. Oh, that actually, I think with some soap that that would feel nice. Okay, not mad at it, that's cool. Next we have Sukin Foaming Facial Cleanser. I'm never gonna have to buy a facial cleanser again. I keep getting more of them. I am trying to use them up, but interested in giving this a try. Paraben free. Purify, cleanse, and lightly hydrate the skin with chamomile, aloe vera, green tea, and witch hazel. All of which are things that my skin like. Well, maybe not the witch hazel so much, but you know, let's see where it's at on the ingredients list. So, aloe is the second ingredient. Chamomile is the Sixth ingredient, it has the flower extract. The hazel extract is the seventh ingredient, it looks like. And it's an extract instead of, you know, actual witch hazel glycerin. Macadamia oil. Evening primrose oil. Tangerine might be a problem, but we'll see. It's a peel oil, so it may not be as much of a problem. I have problems with citrus. My skin tends to react very poorly to citrus. Lavandula, lavender oil. It's at the, near the bottom. They have vanilla near the bottom. I hope you don't smell like lavender. I am not a lavender person. Ooh, 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 do I get to say it? Do I get to say it? Safety seal! I got to say it. I got to say it. All right, let's take this off. Let's take this off. There we go. Okay. Get off my finger. I'm not smelling a whole lot of lavender. Uh, looks like it's pretty full. Oh, maybe it's right there. I can't tell. All right. Just put just a little bit on the back of my hand. Just it's clear. Like that. Feels nice. It actually feels really nice. It's already starting to foam without any water. I'm not getting lavender at all. That is nice. That's a nice. That is actually a really nice fresh scent. Okay, I'm. I'm actually excited to try that. No more glasses again. I can't fucking see, but hey. And then last but not, oh no. Oh, they gave us two of the watermelon thingies. Okay. And then last we have the NYX On The Rise Volume Mascara. Um, I like NYX. I don't think I've tried, I don't think I've tried any of their mascaras in the past. 
I know I tried one of their eyeliners. I don't remember if I tried a mascara. Let's see if I can get this open. It's being stubborn. Because, you know, it's me. Who can't open things. Open. There. All right, so it is in a pink thing. Hopefully, I think the mascara is black. Doesn't say. 95% saw instant volume, 94% saw instant lift. They show before and afters on the back. Don't know how much I feel about those, really. Interesting, I'll be interested and give that a try. Let's take a look at this wand. Okay, it is a spiky plastic wand. Not one of my favorites, but we will give that a shot sometime. I like the smell of that. That I can live with. <laughs> we'll give that a shot sometime. Uh, so, like I said, this was a $10 box. And um, even if you take out the three things that I'm eh about... It's a good box. I'm happy with it. I mean, the candle, the skin cleanser, the the, the uh, sponge pad, and the uh, mascara. I I can I'm I'm fine with that. Honey, get a lighter or get one of your light sticks or something. We are gonna try this candle. Alrighty, alrighty. He's gonna come and he's gonna light it. It's lit. It's crackling. <laughs> well, they claim it sounds, it sounds like a fire. In a fireplace. Do you hear it? Do you guys hear it? That is really neat. And that scent is not annoying. I can live with that. I can live with that. That is cool. I can live with that. Alrighty, so I'm gonna say overall, I am fairly happy with this particular box. This is nice. This was worth the 10 bucks. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with it. And I think my daughter will be really pleased with the stuff that she's gonna get out of it, so. Well, the one thing she's going to get out of it. I, I, don't, I don't know about these. I, I don't know if I want to try them or if I just want to. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hi, Yuriko. At any rate, let me know what you think about the Walmart Beauty Box, the personal self-care box. Uh, I do think it is still available, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to get it up on the channel as soon as possible so you guys could take a look. And uh, let me know what you think. Are you going to pick one up for $10? It doesn't seem that bad. Let me know. Let me know. At any rate, that is it for the day, and I hope you like what you've seen. And if you do like what you've seen, I hope you will subscribe if you haven't yet. When you subscribe, please hit that notification bell so you know when I upload. I currently upload two days a week. That would be Monday and Thursday. However, we have bonus videos. My son opens a Geek Fuel every month. And if you send anything, that also gets opened as a bonus video. And, uh, you know one season towards the summer and stuff we get our plant videos as well not doing them now but anyway so you get one video pretty much guaranteed every month as a bonus video right now uh if you are part of my notification squad please check both your bell and your subscription to make sure they're both still active and if you choose not to subscribe, well, I'd be sad and disappointed. However, I would also understand there's a lot of YouTubers out there. Probably some more interesting than I am. However, you are always welcome back here. And when you do come back again, don't forget to bring your cup of tea. Or a candle. Let's go ahead and give this a sip and we will be on our way. That smell lingers. That smell lingers. It's it's almost vanilla -y kind of, which is not bad. Okay. 
definitely went a little too hard with two bags. Okay, so I'm going to have to remember these are one bag uh, tea. Uh, a lot of teas, when you get them from the grocery store, are not. So, and this is a grocery store tea that we pick up. Yeah, so I, I think it's a little strong for me right now. And it's actually kind of upsetting my stomach a little bit. <laughs> oh, you're not supposed to be doing that. You're supposed to be making me feel better. Uh, but, you know, hey. At any rate, that's it. I hope you have a good one.